Take a 30-kilometer ride towards south of Bikanar in India's northwestern province of Rajasthan, and you land into Deshnok town, a haven for rats. Here you can see people's affection towards the rodents. Their devotion towards rats has its roots in the 15th century Hindu temple of Karni Mata, or Mother Karni, who is believed to be an incarnation of the Hindu goddess Durga. Popularly known as the Temple of Rats, this temple was built in the early 20th century. Stepping into the temple courtyard, you feel like you've landed into a rat's paradise. Rats that scurry about the temple will scare first-timers, but devotees who come often to the temple feed and protect the privileged rodents. They don't even consider them as rats, but as little kids of the goddess Karni. We don't call it rat over here, we call it Kaaba. Kabas. These are not rats. There is nothing to worry about. They won't bite you. I believe in Makarni. That's why I have come here. There are about 20,000 rats living inside the temple premises. Temple volunteers work around the clock to take care of them. The rodents are fed grains, milk, coconut shells, and anything or everything they like. As per a popular legend among locals, goddess Karni asked the death god Yama to give life to one of his devotees. When the death god refused, the goddess reincarnated him as a rat. Since then, rats at the temple are believed to be children of the goddess Karni. Here they have the distinction of living in the home of a deity who is believed to have remedial properties to cure even epidemics such as the plague caused by rats.